Hi everyone, my name is Taisy and welcome to my channel. Today we will paint the chickadee. I am using the 8x10 watercolor paper Canson XL watercolor. And I am using only two watercolor paints Indigo and Clunkdown Gold. I am starting from the sketch with the watercolor pencil dark blue color. I will paint in two layers. The first layer will be wet and red, so I spray the water quite a lot on the paper. Starting with the indigo, I didn't take a lot of paint on the brush and I see that it's spreading much out because the paper is really wet. I am removing the excess water by the paper cloth. If you don't have the indigo, you can use blue and black. Instead of the conacodon, you can use ochre or orange or dark yellow. I am adding the darker parts of the face by the indigo. And I'm adding the Kunakudon gold to the belly. I'm removing the excess paint again, the paint that is spreading out outside the bird. I am adding some more details to the face and I am starting to paint the branch. I am adding some dark to the wing and to the tail. I am detailing the head some by the darker indigo, but not by the thick paint, so when it will dry, it will be lighter. I am adding some saturation to the belly by the quinacridone gold again and to the branch. Since it was a lot of water on the paper, it took more than half an hour to dry, but the paper was still wavy, so more than an hour to dry completely. And we see that the indigo is lighter now, so it's possible to add more details. I am starting from the eye. In the start I was using bigger squirrel brush and now it's smaller and thinner Kolinsky sable. I am adding darker strokes to imitate the feathers. They will dry fast and they will be lighter, so I always can add some more.
I'm starting to paint the pores by the indigo, the thick indigo in the start. I am paying more attention to the head to imitate feather. Since it's wet on dry watercolor effect, it takes small amount of time to dry. I'm adding more details by the Kunakadon Gold. And I'm adding some thick indigo to the branch. And I'm adding also some lighter indigo to the belly. In the end I added some more orange strokes on the tummy, it's not necessary, it's just for more saturation. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the painting of the chickadee. Please write in the comments what you would like to paint next. And see you soon.